What is it? Yeah, that's the pan. Another Ferrari. What's that? F430. Diesel. Holy sh. Shout out Whistling Diesel. Isn't this your truck? Pick a C8 Corvette because they've got literally one of almost every color here. Oh. The BMW Motorsport girls, though. <laughs> Hi. Drive up. Follow me. This guy copied me. Should we ask her for dinner? <laughs> There's a squirrel on your camera. What's going on guys? This is Jake Garino back from Drive Hub. We are in Naples, Florida doing whatever we do. This is the Porsche Taken or whatever it's called and we're gonna have a great day. Turns and lighted information signs located throughout the cabin in addition to any crew. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Drive Hub. And right now my chauffeur Chives, Chives, could you slow it down please? You f***ing <laughs> Holy sh <laughs> Back end went airborne. <laughs> I think I'm okay. <laughs> Holy crap. You're not wearing a seatbelt? Okay, That's safety, dangerous first. and illegal. We're gonna have to cut that out. From New Hampshire. So we're on our way right now to the Ferraris on 5th Concourse. Shut the hell up, Ant. <laughs> I can hear sorry, you giggling. Sorry. We're on our way to the Ferraris on 5th Concourse, which is- Stop touching my weenus. Can I have this now? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. We're on our way to the Ferraris on 5th Concourse, which is probably the best show I could ever go to. Some incredible cars. Koenigseggs, there's Bugattis, there's McLaren Senna's, there's Ferrari F40s, F50s, some unbelievable stuff. Guess who's gonna instigate the What a loser! He goes, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, please don't rear end it. Please don't fing rear end that thing. Look at the house. Flowers. Do you actually like flowers? Another. Well, this one's actually white. I saw the ceramic gray metallic or whatever it's called. And I gotta say, I like the ceramic color more, but this thing is still wicked cool. Look at this CTSV coupe. Is it a stick shift? It is! Holy crap. So this is probably one of the rarest things here then, a, C a V Coupe? V Coupe manual, Steffi. It's a manual. I hate the wheels in the spoiler. You hate the wheels? Yeah, I'm not a huge fan. This guy's copying me. This guy is copying me. Look at this. Unbelievable. They must have seen my video. This thing would be a lot cooler if it wasn't... If it... Yeah, the sparkle in the paint. Six hundred. Well, they've got five fifty-six from the factory, so. Yeah. yeah. Do you see the yellow barrels, Chris? Yeah. I don't know if I like that. I mean, I don't mind it. I'm not a huge fan of. I don't think he needs the yellow barrels if he did the yellow calipers. Yeah. I bet he watched my video on how to do that. I'm sure he did. Ah, oh, but a C8 and Zeus bronze. This color's wild. What do you guys think of this Zeus bronze color? Do you guys like this better than the ceramic gray that I put on my Instagram and TikTok a few days ago? I do. These things are awesome. I can't wait till I get my ride in one of these things. Fee, do you know what the SYC is? Stands for... I don't know, but I don't like it. It's an automatic. It's... Oh, okay. Yellow Ford GT. I gotta go. Sorry. Oh my god. One of my absolute dream cars. I like the yellow. I don't like the. I don't like the pinstriping. It looks like a mustache. What is the bullet though? Bullets for Mustang. I don't know what. It's got all the. I don't know if that's. Any sort of info? It's an interesting way to. Definitely an interesting way to spec your Ford GT. Look at the shifter and the armrest in yellow. I like where you fill it up. Yeah. Look at the girth of these tires. Oh my god. Yeah, see the seats are factory, but I don't know why they put the dumb yeah. armrest and the shifter and those flame floor mats. That might be, just be like a pad that goes over it. That's wild. Hello. Are they all supercharged? Yep. 5.4 liter supercharged. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's 16 injectors on there. Wow, do you see who built it? The guy right here? Yep. Signed. 
The guy who builds the engine signs it. He's got all sorts of, he's got like stick on, oh. No, <laughs> not the Ford GT. <laughs> Do it to a Civic, but not the GT. Pretty cool, you got the old GT500 and the new one. I really like ZL1s. I drove the generation after this ZL1, the black one, and it was insane. It was absolutely insane. Steffi, that's a super snake. That's got a thousand horse. That's pretty fast. <laughs> this is something that looks good in all black. I like this. The bad stripes are definitely my favorite. Yeah. Absolutely. This is how I'd spec one of these, I think, if I got one. For sure. Wow, they are great dancers. I would like to join them. Would you like to dance? What do you think, Steffi? You've got a BMW. Should we get it? Just, I... uh... It's cheap. It's on sale. I can make one for 300 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> My entire car costs $9,000. Yeah, so you <laughs> could buy, what, a hood? <laughs> That's one piece of a car. <laughs> or you could have a whole car. <laughs> For, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it just it makes more sense to just buy the whole car. It's just not. And then it would move on its own power and everything. Or whatever. <laughs> I mean, you could slide down the hill on that thing. <laughs> I, just, I wouldn't hang it on my wall. <laughs> what do you guys think of this white Testarossa, huh? This thing just screams the 80s. <laughs> Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> that is wild. Oh my God. Like, look at that. How, like, it's wild. I feel like Jordan Belfort. Jordan Belfort. Jordan, Jordan Belfort. Jordan Very Belfort. good, Ant. This one looks wild yeah. in the yellow helmet. Yeah. That can't be a factory thing. I don't know. Gray on red is another killer combo. Wow. Ferrari brand valve stems. Probably eight grand a piece. Again, almost as much as my car. Did you see who's, who's on the inside? It's just uh, an interesting ride overall. It is interesting. Wow. Uh, Look at this, guys. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, dude, look, look at the crushed carbon. That's called forged carbon. Forged nice try. Crushed, crushed you know. carbon. We'll, we'll, we'll give you a pass for that one. Huracan Performante, 918 Spider, P1, and a Senna. Unbelievable. That car was actually at Naples Motorsports last time I was here. And this one was here years ago. If you go back on my Instagram, like two years, that one's on there. Now the biggest question is, which one would you take? P1 all day. P1? I... Yeah, I think I'd be the P1 as well. Look at this thing, guys. Absolutely wild. Look at this wing. Holy shit. Whoever is my bull from Massachusetts, hit me up. <laughs> I wanna go for a ride. Liberty Walk hit on it. Oh, something. Wow, look at those wheels. Holy crap. This is, this is garbage. You guys don't like this? Cheap. Oh, it's cheap. I think it's pretty it's I cool. It's pretty cool, but, it's cool, I think but you can see the blemishes. What is it? Look at the exhaust. They took it off a Ford Tempo. And <laughs> the wrap job looks like it was a gold grandma's garage. <laughs> and they used the what? same paint that they used on the exhaust on the engine. Yeah. 8181 Bitcoin. Ah, oh, that's what that is. Huh. Dumbass. Ty, what do you think the exhaust is, though? Look at the. Wastegate dumps, it's twin turbo. Are you serious? Maybe. Hefner twin turbo, done by Hugh himself. <laughs> yeah, first. Is it twin turbo, really? Yeah, look at it. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, sorry. <laughs> it's definitely a waste game though. Don't look close in the light there. Like it this. needs to be lower. It needs to sit on wow. the floor. Wow. Oh, yeah. Jeez. Ohio wastegates. Yeah. Another casual CA just hanging around. Oh, yeah. <laughs> A hundred and twenty-four grand for this thing. I don't know, guys. Would you pay a hundred and twenty-four grand, almost a hundred and thirty thousand dollars for a C8? Holy crap! I like that. I don't know if that's my style or not. The 812 Super Fast, one of my personal favorites. A bargain at $364,000. Hey, Kona Big Wave, that's, my, that's one of my favorite beers, fun fact. Yeah, I love car these things. Things. Well, with the Ford GT hat? Uh, sure, you think? <laughs> what if you crash that top? Well, I think the first... <laughs> Yeah, the first idea is to not crash it. And then we worry about what you do if you crash it. Which one would you rather have though? I think I'd rather the delivery. I take blue. Oh, I take blue all day long. Oh, yeah. I like the Like that's cool, the maybe martini. a little more rare, but no. That, yeah. This, that color is... Yeah. Would you rather have this gen or the other gen though? Old. This gen. Really? I'd rather the old one. I'd much rather the old one. Mm. I don't know, that's tough. What is a V6? This yeah, true. This twin turbo. Yeah, I'd say. But it's uh, not a true muscle. Yeah, the other one is supercharged, so supercharged V8. Ooh, is this one's one of 50. Which one would you guys prefer, the Heritage Edition or the regular one? I definitely would rather the Heritage Edition, though I wouldn't mind taking that one. I kind of like it. That is intriguing. What do you guys think of the GT2 RS? I do like the carbon fiber bits everywhere. You guys are, you're a Porsche guy though. I don't, I don't know. There are cars I would take before this. No, this thing's pretty freaking sweet. I don't like sweet. the silver, but. Another C8. Horrible color combo. It's pretty bad. Ew. Chris, what do you think of the color, <laughs> color combo on that though? Yeah, I don't like the seats. You think the C6 looks better than the C8? <laughs> Might be a little bit biased, but I don't know. I just, if I spec a C8, I don't think I'd do bright red interior. Yeah, but bright red interior. Foxy Garage, his wide body C8. That thing's sweet. All black. Shout out Toxic Garage. The Martini Edition 918 Spider for 1.6 million. What would you guys think if I did a color like this on the vet? The more I see yellow, the more that I kind of like it. Corvette Racing's yellow. I think it would be a pretty sharp color on the vet. So let me know what you guys think. What, what is it? Yeah, that's the pants. That's the pants. Wow. Holy crap, guys. Look at this thing. The pinned wide body kit. Oh my god. This looks amazing. That wing. Holy shit. What do you guys think of this pandem wide body C8 Corvette? This is nuts. With the wing and everything. I hope that the Z06 C8 looks something like this. They've got to do a wide body. Because this, this just looks too good. You put it next to a standard C8. And there's just no comparison. What a wild looking car. This is arguably one of my favorites at this show. Well, pick a C8 Corvette because they've got literally one of almost every color here. This all black, I must say, Z51. Does look pretty wild. Look at the different wing options. You get this one. You get the smaller wing, smaller wing on that one. 
And then you got the high wing. This one must come with the Z51 pack. And then we got the actual convertible, not just the target top like these ones. 2020 C8 convertible. Look at the mechanism. Look at all of that. Wow. Which one would you guys prefer, the convertible or the Targa top? I think I'd have to go with the Targa on this one. I wish they had the roof all the way down so we could actually see what it looks like, but this one's a Z51 convertible as well. That's pretty cool. More and more C8s. We got another one in silver. Haven't seen a silver one yet since I've been here and only seen one of these ones in motion. I do love this color. Can't think off the top of my head what this color is called. It's almost like a Ford Grabber blue. The white interior, kind of cool looking, I gotta say. If you guys could pick any one of these C8s, which one would you have? I kind of like the black on black Z51 with the high wing over there, but I think this bright blue is a close second place. No, it's, it's Anthony Scaglietti. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, it's Anthony uh, Spaghettioli. <laughs> I could see myself in one of these. They're like 80 grand. This over 80? Uh, Mercy. What? What did you just say? This over the Mercy. I like the Gallardo over the Mercy? There's, there's no, no. Why is it so much money? I think oh, because it's only got less than 5,000 miles. Another Ferrari. What's that, F430? <laughs> oh, my bad. Really go up big. to your doctor's office, mm -hmm. Dr. Stefanelli. Oh yeah, Dr. Attractive. Stefanelli, it's got a good ring to it. Yeah. Anesthesia. <laughs> There's a squirrel on your camera. There's a squirrel on your camera. Look at the uh, aluminum foil wrapped around the engine. That is aluminum foil, very good. I don't think so. In case you gotta cook eggs at the track. Of course. Awful good advertising for a bike shop. How many bikes do you think you had to sell? 800,000. Probably a couple. Oh, that's one of those evolutions, isn't it? The yeah. hammer. The hammer? That's what they called me in high school. <laughs> <laughs> not a Cosworth. These are super rare. I don't think it is a Cosworth. It's, it's not, not an evolution for Cosworth, not. whatever it is. Yeah, it looks still rare. Uh, I think I had this car once. <laughs> 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 what year is that? 2000. Wow. It's, it's the E500, e, e right? Yep. Just like mine with two tones. What's just the same? I like it. Maybe it's your car. I don't know. Mine kind of blew up by Miramar outlet oh, malls. Oh, <laughs> it might not be it then. I'm sure they restored it so much. <laughs> well, if this was actually baby. her car, should we ask her for dinner later or something? Uh, yes. Hey, uh, that was your Mercedes I saw back there. You want to go to? You want to go out? E30. Wow. Nice. I love this color. Oh, this is the M3 CS. Hey, here's me. And then it's Ant's car. Is this yours? Yeah. Oh, he's got the stick though. Oh, because sticks are cooler than automatics. And you suck. The color. Look at the doors on this. They go down. slide down. The doors slide down into the car. That's pretty cool. That's what I said. You're right. welcome. Look at the BMW Motorsport girls, though. <laughs> Hi. Drive up. Follow me. One that we drove or started might have been a year older. What do you think? I think we started the M8. But it oh, it was it the was M8. A year yeah. Older than a younger and wiser Jake. How much Less you gonna wise, spend? 113. Would you do it? No. Are you serious? 113 thousand dollars. I could get something cooler for you. You could get a well. I mean, if you have friends that you wanted to put in the back, I guess. But definitely don't have many friends. But I have stuff I could put in the back. That's true. But you could also put stuff in the back of a Corvette like mine, which costs nine thousand dollars. I think these are BBS. You think those are BBS? RCs. I had them on the GLI. Oh yes, the good old GLI. May it rest in pieces. Pretty sharp. Oh no, that's a final detail right there. <laughs> hey, look, a C5. In case none of you guys realized it, based on the door, that's a C5 underneath. And it's all rebodied on the outside. And, and I don't like it. Holy sh. Shut up, whistling diesel. Isn't this your truck? I could have sworn I've seen this in a video. Take a picture, tag on it. 
It has, yeah. If any of you guys know if this is Whistlin' Diesel's truck, or old truck, it's got the the decal in it. I don't know if someone bought it, if he got rid of it before he destroyed it, but it's here. but there's something about the C7 ZR1 with this massive wing that just looks wicked good. 755 horsepower from a supercharged V8 and you could still get a manual. This one of course not equipped with it but still insane that massive hood that's actually the engine and they couldn't yeah. fit it under the hood. It's insane. I know. 755 horsepower, that insane front fascia, and you can still take the roof off of it. Pretty cool. Definitely yellow. Definitely, Definitely yellow. yellow. What do you guys think of this color with the matching calipers? I don't know, that's, that's bright. It's very bright. And once again, this is Jake Garino signing off from Naples, Florida, behind this beautiful C8 Corvette. Thank you all for joining me. Subscribe, like, like, subscribe. It's great. Happy motoring.